Hello everybody, welcome back to part 17 of Persona 5. Last time we got the treasure from Kamashida's palace. We only have hey. one day remaining. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna see the results now. We also checked to see what happened if we lost. I did so intentionally because I had like two days, three days left and I wanted to see it. So yeah. The game doesn't stop you from doing something like that. It doesn't stop you anytime soon from making that mistake. It just lets you enter LeBlanc and then it tells you, weren't we forgetting something? What's with the sudden morning assembly? Oh, I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. Rude. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got cancelled, though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. Principal Potato. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through. But it will take time until she recovers. What was his name? I, th I think... It's in the back of my head. I'm thinking it was, and it's a pretty big name, Kobayakawa? I think it was. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... <sighs> Mr. Kamashita, what's the... I... have been reborn. Well, I guess we succeeded. That is why... I will confess everything to you all. Turn up the volume a little for me. Huh? There we go. What's wrong with Mr. Kamoshida? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Verbally abusing students. Physically abusing my team and sexually harassing female students. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Also, On is the only one with, uh, with eyes. Just, okay, you might as well have given them eyes. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he oh, say that himself? Uh, he is Holy the worst. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of the school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. That might be a little bit too much. What? Did he just say that? Would kill himself? Don't get me wrong, I don't like the guy, but he needs to pay for what he did, not kill himself. Mr. Kamashita, that's the please get off the stage for now. Yeah, that's the coward's way out. Everyone, return to your classes! I... Don't run, you bastard! Shiho's still alive! Even after all the things that made her want to die, you have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Disgusting. Ugh. For a position on the team? I feel so That's bad horrible. for Takamaki-san. So the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. <laughs> Someone please call the police! The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately! I'm actually surprised he didn't call the police himself, though. Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? <laughs> was something done to Kamashita? 
Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Who knows? <laughs> but man, Kamashita turned out to be one sick bastard. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the ball? Do you think to will show up? This now? is gonna be a big Return problem. to your classrooms at once! His heart really did change. Castle of Lust Falls. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? I think so. Yeah, it's gotta be. But things are happening way too fast. Huh? What the? Takamaki-san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. I didn't know at all. Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Dude, there's no need to yell. You're standing next to us. If you were five meters away, you could start yelling and come closer. Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Yeah, I think Mishima is gonna be uh, an important character, even though he just kinda was, because of his uh, more unique design. Also, we got a name from him, and the other two were just tall student and black haired student. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. Yeah. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? <laughs> eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. For real? Very coincidental that it happens just when he confesses. It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. She, oh, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide... People will label her after that. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea, too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. And I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. She's alive. You can see her anytime. I need to change too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady An. 
No matter how much of a shit bag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Yeah, and that's why I said you're not that type of person. Huh? That's not it. Oh. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life, you know? Okay, so it's the opposite. She just wants to make him suffer. I just believe there are fates worse than death. Yeah, but actually that kind of sounds like Batman. I didn't kill him. No, you broke his back, his legs, his neck. Can't move, needs to eat out of a straw. But yeah, he's still alive. This guy, oh, he's brain dead. But technically, he still has a heartbeat, so he's alive too. So yeah. <laughs> Whatever makes you sleep. Holy shit. Whatever helps you sleep at night. Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone. Wanna check it out? N not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Yeah, about that? Weird rumors about you guys are already going around. About you guys? You're part of this too, you know? Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. Oh, you mean real life threats? The hell? People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm, makes sense. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. <laughs> Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. 10,000. That's what I'm guessing. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Well, it's three times as much as I thought. Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. Let me think, 100 yen per... 300 euros. Okay, 300 is not bad. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you! Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? Uh... Interest my ass! I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Hey, wait! Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. I owe money, so I can't complain. Yeah, but Shiho is still in the hospital and she can't come if we're gonna talk about phantom thievery. So that might not be the best idea. You good with that? Fine on me, I want ramen. Naruto! We should save the money. Yeah, fine by me, even though we probably should save the money. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. When should we go? Wanna do it soon, like tomorrow? Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the fifth, on Children's Day. So, who's going to sell this? So three days. Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. <laughs> yeah, 15 minutes of story. The story is getting quite far now. Well, getting along ah, quite nicely. You're back. Highly doubt we're even a quarter into the game. Is this gold medal real? When did it get uh, inside his palace? I don't think that's it. No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. The real medal should still be in his possession. Kamashida is the real one. What? You're telling me Kamashida still got the medal? 
Who cares? What matters is that we changed his heart. And anyway, if we had taken the real thing, that'd be stealing. I don't think he'll be proud of that medal anymore regardless. You let go of stuff pretty easy, huh? Wanna forget about my debt? That's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for a middle schooler, you know? Do you even still have that dolphin anyway? Dolphin? Stop digging that up! Back in middle school, we went on a field trip to the aquarium. But Hiyuji had to spend all his money on souvenir, so I lent him some for the trade fair. I said I was sorry, it was for my mom. Well, I guess I can call it even after all we've been through. Thanks. Anyway, we don't we don't gotta worry about selling that metal off if it's a fake. End of story. Yes. Kamishida will never be proud of that once in a lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. <sighs> Must be nice to have such time off starting tomorrow. For me it's just it just means more customers and even more work. Wanna talk? Mm -hmm. No matter where you go during Golden Week, it's packed with office workers on vacation. Why does everyone have to take a break at the same time? That's what I wonder every single time. A plant. Nice. Still pretty healthy. Oh, that's not what What's I wanted. Up? Yes, oh please. I didn't think I could actually do something like that. Uh, sure, protective stuff. Of drama. Oh yeah, you can watch DVDs now, right? We should go to the rental shop sometime. Okay, and what was it about a beam? Train. Oh, you wanna in do it? In the mood to do some training? Training in your room. Training in your room will cause time to pass, but will raise your max HP. Oh, that would be useful. The more you train, the greater the effect will be. Check your schedule and use your time wisely. So basically, okay. now. I'm actually surprised the game lets me do this right now. Yes! Without further ado, let's begin your training. Okay. Alright, you can do this. Clear your mind and focus on your center. Don't give up. Push past your limit. Ooh. Hey! Hey, are you alright? You haven't built up much muscle, so don't push yourself. Nice going! It seems you've gained some strength. Yeah, great. All right. My HP increased by five. Okay, that's quite a lot, actually. Well then. Well, it's getting late. Why don't you get some sleep? Okay then. A five HP above what was it? One sixteen? One eighteen? Pretty good. Oh no, wait. That was before I grinded before the fight. Yeah. So yeah, this part is gonna be very story driven. Okay. Come on, we're going to the pawn. We're going to pawn that metal today. I was. I thought I was gonna say gonna go to the pawn shop. Hey, you can hear me, right? You don't have plans, do you? Come help me out instead of sleeping your life away. Eh, we do owe it to him. We'll just have to wait. Hurry down and help him out. But well, I did say that would be a lot of customers. <sighs> <laughs> Sorry I kind of pressured you into doing this. And now to our next topic, Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently a high school coach admitted to his school that he had been perpetually abusing students. Given his prior Olympic, uh, Olympic, given his prior Olympic achievements, this ha has caused quite a stir. What caused his habitual of... Mm. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess his heinous crimes to his entire school? The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises all the time. It was scary, but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There were always rumors, sure, but many people believed them, though. Not many believe. Uh, not many people believed them, though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. Hey. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it. Jeez. <sighs> Things might be getting turbulent at school. 
but you need to just keep your head down, alright? More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Yeah. Sheep really worked as hard. Probably asking if we sold it yet. Did you see? It was on the news! No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Shio's name didn't come up, right? Not that I saw. I bet, I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do now is eat some tasty shit and put all this crap behind us. I don't think you want to eat tasty shit, but still shit. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try not I'll try not to let you guys down. Alright, we need to go sell the gold medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants your help, make sure you turn him down, okay? I highly doubt I can do that, but okay. Yay, another day passed. Time flies. Well, we're already in the fifth month, and I think they said it was half a year? That passed, so... Make sure to do the dishes. Uh, when I get back to chores already, I can't right now. I can't right now. <sighs> Don't get cocky with me. Welcome. Huh? Am I interrupting something? Uh, that explains why she knew me. Not at all. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh, is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Sorry, my finger is itchy. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Th that's exactly the case. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? What's it to you? No, Shujin Academy. Oh, someone I know goes there as well. Hmm. I've heard that things are rough right now. Yeah. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? Hmm. So she was already interrogate. Uh, well, not interrogating. She was already investigating this before my interrogation. Well, I know it's her case, but she was on this case really quickly. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. Okay then. Take your time. Shall we go? Like take your heart. All right, today's the day we turn that metal for uh, turn in that metal for cash. You know some place that'll buy it off you, right? Yep, the airsoft shop. Oh, I can only fast travel to two locations. That's odd. Uh, so this is the place. Looks like it. Let's just take care of this. Wait, we don't have the search warrant yet. Just be patient, I'm sure we'll get one soon enough. They'd never think about running off down this narrow alley. So yeah, someone's talking about not running off that way. And a warrant, so I'm guessing they're detectives. I wonder what this guy did to piss off detectives. Huh? Huh, you again? What do you want? I want you to buy this. Huh? A gold medal? Why do you have this? We don't buy any fake or stolen goods here, kid. Hey. Hold on a sec. Let me see it. Technically it's a fake, but it's still gold. Mm. I'm just not gonna ask where you got this. How's 30,000 yen sound for it, though? <laughs> That's not enough. <laughs> the both of us know you ain't find another buyer for that thing. Just take your 30k. Well, it was worth a shot. Yay. It's almost time. 
Here, take this with you. It's a uh, thanks for selling me that metal. But uh, best not to open it. Just bring it back when you... Bring it with you next time you come back here. That's a little weird. What's, uh, I'm not gonna ask what's inside. It's uh, an airsoft shop. He might just take a gun and shoot me in the head. Even though it's airsoft, some of those guns uh, shoot pretty hard. That can still hurt you if you get shot in the head. Or hand, or whatever. Got it. Glad you're so quick to understand. <laughs> They're here. What's with the names? Munehisa Iwai, yes? There are some matters we'd like to discuss with you today. Go, kid. Yeah, I might as well leave. Do you know why we're here? Come on, leave. <laughs> I don't know. Looking for evidence? You tell me, Detective Sam. Watch your attitude. Well, you guys gonna search me? Go on. Do what you gotta do. What was that? An upstanding citizen supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Are you sure that lead was legitimate? I could have sworn it was. <laughs> Can you two hurry it up? I got a business to run here. You bastard. Hey, you! What's in the bag, huh? Show me. The kid's just a regular old customer. You can check the tapes if that'll convince you. They'll show everything that's gone down here today. I don't want to be here when the detectives see the footage of me with that gold medal. Yeah, that's that might not be a good idea. I should leave. I won't let you get away with that easy. Show us what's in the bag. None of your business should actually be going. I don't feel like it. Uh, none of your business is probably the best one. Because I should be going is a... Uh, Pretty much saying there is something in there that makes me look guilty of something. I don't feel like it's just being arrogant to the police, and we know what happens in Japan when you are arrogant to the police, at least in this game. It's none of your business, it's basically just, even in Japan, a constitutional right. If they don't have a war warrant, they are not allowed to search me without, a, uh, without probable cause. And there is no probable cause. <laughs> I said show it to me. Hey, you're talking to a kid, remember? Besides, besides, he's not the one we're here to see. Ah. That's right, Detective Sam. Maybe next time try not harassing my customers? See how that goes. Yeah, also the attitude with, with, with uh, which he spoke to me. Good thing there's one decent detective between the two. See ya. Safe trip home, kid. Also, the one in the black suit, the vulgar detective, uh, kind of reminds me of one of the guys that beat the shit out of me at the start of the game while they were starting the interrogation and drugged me so yeah mm. what were those detectives doing there more importantly aren't you curious about what's in the bag a little well okay come on let's open it up yeah, you don't even give me a chance to say no. Hey, wait! A real gun? Wait, I think it's just a model. It's incredible, though. Miles ahead of the one Ryuji had. There's something weird about that place. Hey, hey! Hey, Issei, I just had a great idea. We should totally buy this gun from him later. Yeah, and what about the money? I mean, it's perfect. Something this real looking would work wonders in the metaverse. Anyway, he told you to bring it back the next time you came, right? Now's our chance! You should try striking a deal with him when we go to return it. Got paper bag. Not gun in bag, just paper bag. Aunt's calling me. Oh, hello, it's me. I saw the news, you know, about Kamishida? It's getting a lot of coverage. So as I'm right, it's a little scary. How do you feel? She almost lost a friend, so we're gonna ask her how she's feeling now. I don't know. Also, those are big earrings. You made Jesse from Pokemon look jealous. Actually, no, that's pretty much the same size. The reaction's been bigger than what I was expecting? I guess I'm just surprised. I don't think we did anything wrong, though. I wonder if we helped those people speak up about it. I'm sure we did. That's pretty amazing, huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. And yet, look at us now. This calls for celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late. 
Oh, and did you pawn off that medal? You didn't forget, right? It'll all be okay, I remembered, I'll tell you later. I remembered. Also gonna move a little forward because one of the lights from my computer is shining straight into my eyes. Good to hear. I already made reservations. You should be really excited about the place I chose, by the way. I'm sure everyone's gonna love it. Well, see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> ah, a, resta a restaurant of Lady Aunt's choosing. Finally a decent meal. Hey, what do you think we're going to eat? Sushi? Hoping barbecue? Might be Chinese. I'm thinking sushi. But expensive su sushi. Ooh, tuna, sea urchin, and maybe even salmon roe. <laughs> In any case, I'm surely looking forward to it. <laughs> okay then. I'm not gonna do the <laughs> of whatever okay. it was. Big celebration tomorrow. Let's go get some sleep. Plant. Nice. Pretty healthy. Can I make stuff? Nope. I'm just gonna let me sleep. I'm Let's gonna save though. Uh, not this one. I made sure that I was able to save over the previous one. Okay. Come on, I said go to bed. <laughs> it's tomorrow. I can't wait. Sleep. Come on, do we get Igor? Igor cutscene. Ah. I was hoping we'd get an Igor cutscene since we destroyed the palace. Apparently we didn't. Sad. Okay, that's not sushi. Mm. <laughs> so good. No wonder Lady An chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah, I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. Also, even if they suspect us, they have zero proof of us doing anything to change his mind. So yeah. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. Yeah, some of them were being abused by him, of course they're gonna be grateful. Huh. The Phantom Aficionado website? Paw? P-A-W? Paw? Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels... strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? Are we good on time? You planning on eating? Well, of course I'm gonna eat, but... <gasps> this place has a time limit! Oh crap! We only got an hour to eat! <laughs> Just 50 minutes left! Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace! Honestly, I think it would've been better to order less, come back another time and spend another hour, but... instead of stuffing yourself now with everything... I'll... I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu! Unless, of course, it's an all-you-can-eat evening. But that would be very coincidental that they chose the fifth to do with this. Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys, too. Don't worry. Because Ryuji offer, uh, not offered, um, proposed the date. And, yeah, Aunt chose the place, so... If this was an all-out, all-you-can-eat buffet only for that day, then it would have been kind of suspicious, even though it's a, a holiday, if I'm not mistaken, there, as they said themselves. Oh, man. God melts in my mouth. Don't think dirty, don't think dirty, don't think dirty. Seriously? Only meat? That's not helping, Morgana. Now, where should I start? And she's all about the cake! So happy! <laughs> hey, calories. Wow. Shut up! Wow! How much do you think one of these costs? 
I'll never get the chance to do this again! Mmm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! <laughs> and where's our share? We're eating soup, or at least I think it's soup. I didn't really know what you'd want, so I just grabbed you some beans. Really? B beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there too, so we got you a variety of those. Really? Morgana is a cat and you come up with beans? At least go for sushi. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. More beans. M more yeah. beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. This is just plain grotesque. Yeah, let's take another one of the plates and just... Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. Yeah, are we actually gonna get to take food? Fine dining, I'll need help. Leave it to me. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Yeah. Wait patiently for our return. Hmm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Not helping Ryuji. Okay, so it's only natural that we go get our food now because they were supposed to take some for us and they came with beans, so this time they can watch the stuff. Oh, this part's cream cheese! I'm not even gonna go there. They're not even listening. I'm not, I'm not even gonna go there with cream cheese. As I'd, ex as I'd expect from the buffet at the top class hotel, the ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good. There's a reason it costs 8,000 yen, really, and that's with three of us. That's 24,000, if I'm not mistaken, so I get 60,000 remaining. They have a lot here, but fish should come first. Let's fill our plate with all sorts of fish. Which table do you think they're at? Meat. Fish. <laughs> oh look, there's a fish! I prefer it raw, but the grill is great too. Calm down, Happy. Have you heard, my dear, the news about that Kamoshida fellow? Oh, it's a woman. Whoops. <laughs> Have you heard, my dear, the news about that Kamoshida fellow was absolutely dreadful. Alright, that teacher at Shujin Academy caught doing such indecent acts. Shameful, really. Hold on a sec. And they still haven't managed to solve that horrible psychotic break. Those horrible and psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted. I accidentally tapped. Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I honestly pity those poor Shujin students, though. Hmm, sounds like the Kamoshida incident is a talk of the town. Hmm? Shoot, they noticed you. Just grab some food and act natural. Stop meowing! <laughs> they keep looking at me because you're meowing like crazy. On the plus side, we'll get to eat the food later. How did a child like this end up in here? I certainly hope he didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan free. Thank you very much. Come, let us go. Fancy. What's so bad about kids coming to enjoy a buffet? Well, it can, it, it can kind of get rowdy depending on the age of the kids. Our age is probably kind of decent, even though An and Ryuji might be eating like pigs. Um, but if you get someone that's a group of 12 year olds, then things might get messy. Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Maybe there, there are more people we can eavesdrop on at other tables. Giant dessert. Close, it looks even bigger and more delicious. This giant sweet. Oop, I, I got distracted. News travels fast. It's already all over the internet. You know, the story about how Kamashida got his ass kicked by some world re reforming heroes? It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far fetched. Don't worry about it. We just have to do what they tell us to do. It's all rumors made up by school kids anyway. If it's gripping news, who cares if it's not true? So they don't believe themselves, but they're making up stories to make the Phantom Thieves seem real. 
And they're doing this right in front of the actual Phantom Thieves. Mm hmm. Oh, act fast and get some food. Make sure you've got a lot of whipped cream. Oh god, Morgana. This entire conversation about food, about cream and meat and mouth and explosions. <sighs> What's wrong? Ah, nothing. I thought some weird kid was looking at us, that's all. Why don't we go? It's almost time for the meeting. Also, Morgana, get back in the bag. Well, that was rude. Did you hear him? He said you were weird. Yeah, I think you're the weird one. Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Okay. Salad. Hmm. I wonder how the other people... Oh. Okay, so salad is not counted as food, apparently. Oh. What did it say? Hey, it'll be a problem if they figure out who Reeve's dropping. Let's pretend to get some food. There are some meat dishes nearby. Okay, so get the meat. Come on. Ah, meat. I know Ryuji, but a meal is just not the same if you don't have any... I got distracted again. When you really look at it... A haughty subordinate. I'm guessing it's male. When you really look at it, he's just an ex-athlete who overestimated himself. He should have just accepted his lot, of, his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. It's not even an incident that can... Uh, it's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should probably look into it, but we can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida? They don't sound very enthusiastic about it, though. Hmm? Ah, uh, grab some food! Ah. Uh, get the party that's not... Get the part that... N n n n three times! Ah. Uh, get the part that's not too fatty. Okay, then. He's going to be arriving soon. We don't want to keep him waiting, so we better get going, too. What is he going to discuss with the higher-ups? Well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. They were dressed quite well, but they still look pretty shady to me. Yeah, um, for some reason I have a feeling that pretty much everyone I've listened to, except for the two women at the beginning, were here for the same reason, to meet someone. Because both of them talked about a meeting starting soon in a hotel. I know there are hotels with uh, meeting rooms and all, but a little bit too coincidental. Hmm. I wonder how the other people are reacting. Here are reacting to the news, let's get some more food on this evening. Rice. Rice is incredible! It's a cornerstone of every great meal, and I'm running out of time. <laughs> Sorry, I got a bit carried away there, yeah, me too. So the ratings for the news were really that good? It was because it was about the teacher who sexually harassed his students, huh? Was it Kamishida? It's all about how you frame it. You've got to... You've You've got to cater to the idiotic public. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. How can he be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamashida. By the way, do you think these sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, that's... Hmm? We grab some food. Ooh, and don't forget the crispy bits. Because he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed to all his crimes? <laughs> who knows? Sorry, but uh, it's time, I have to go. See? Another one that has to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. All three people I listened in, in on, all three need to go to a meeting at the same time. A sudden change of heart? Huh. I suppose I can't blame him for seeing it that way. I don't think there's anyone else we can listen in on. But it's shocking. So, man so many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. Now, according to what we heard, it seems like it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamishida. Well, now that you've got the nice variety of food on our plates, let's head back to the others. Also, the people I listen in on are a TV station director, I think it was director. An IT conglomerate, well, IT director of something, and a subordinate on his high horse. I have no clue what those are. Yeah, maybe they're not meeting with each other. Unless it's about cameras oh. or something. 
Ooh, you brought a ton back. You brought back a ton. What do you think about coming up against some ritzy, f such ritzy food? Happy? Just want to eat. I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. I just took a lot of food. I just want to eat. I was thinking that too. But take a bite. Using better ingredients makes stuff. Wait. Using better ingredients makes stuff taste way different. Oh, that Man. way. Look at you, acting like you have a refined palate all of a sudden. Wait. Don't you think they're eating too much, Mona? You're eating too much? There's no knowing when we'll get to come here again. <sighs> sure, but you guys brought back loads of food. Be ashamed to let it all go to waste. Why don't you help the art, Ryuji? We should both help. Oh, me? I'm way too stuffed. I couldn't possibly help. Yeah, stuff in your face with cake. Damn it. Whatever. Issei, Morgana, let's deal with this ourselves. <laughs> we failed. It feels like no matter how much we eat, the amount of food we have stays the same. Yeah, that's because it's a video game. <laughs> There's still more? Don't give up. Let's keep at it. <sighs> we did it. My belt feels multiple sizes too small. Y yeah. This is a victory. For all of us. That was a breeze. It was tough. Is this a game to you? <laughs> Am I a game to you? <laughs> not exactly? <laughs> Good job, you guys. How about one last dish to cleanse your palates? I recommend the seasonal tart. The grapefruit has both alluring sweetness and a tangy sourness. Stop. I don't want to hear about sour stuff. Burp. I can't burp. I, I physically can't burp, so... <laughs> This isn't good. I gotta go to the bathroom. <sighs> me too. Please, carry me gently. Well, my character seems fine. Wait. My, look at the table. They must not normally have the opportunity to eat such exquisite food. I can only imagine what their parents must be like. Huh? What was that? Huh? Damn it. We don't got time for that. Come on. Let's go! Yeah, no, I'm physically incapable of burping. <laughs> Each time something... Ugh, I'm stuffed. Each time something like a burp should come out, it's just... Some gargling thing. You know, like when you... Uh, I don't know how you say it in English. When you put water in your mouth, you pull, you pull your head back and then start... Uh, uh, saying... Uh, and it just goes behind in your mouth, and then you have to spit it out like mouthwash and stuff. Yeah, I think it. I think you do that with mouthwash too. With mouthwash too. Definitely use antibiotics for a, a sore throat like that. Well, an infected throat like that. Bacterial infection. Um. Yeah. I got a photo. Never mind. <laughs> Random uh, text message with a photo attached to it. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. <laughs> Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? Most likely ground level. There's still no update on the case. That looks like the same character model as the guy we we punched. Well, punched physically assaulted. The one that was attacking the woman in our flashback. So either they reuse the model, or that's him. If it's him, our character should recognize him. Not yet. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? Also, it's not something you should be concerned with. Also, Haughty Subordinate, uh, unless they reuse the name, that's one of the people we listened in on. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it! Hey, you're cutting in line! What do you want? <laughs> Apologize to Ryuji. 
My guts need to be at least bold to say that. What do you want? We were here first. My guts need to leave. What do you So basically say nothing. We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? Wow. What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. The voice just now. Yeah, it is the guy, isn't it? It has to be the same guy. Otherwise, he wouldn't recognize the voice. Bossy guy. Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but. Also, I'm running out of time. That dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. The man's voice. It sounded almost like the one from back then. What's wrong? I guess it is the same guy. I'm okay, just a little light-headed. Don't worry about it. I'm just a little light-headed. You not feeling good? Probably ate too much. He almost never eats well after all. Plus, I'm always stuck eating canned cat food. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! Yeah, I'm trying to keep an eye on the clock because I have 30... No, 53 minutes. And, like, 95 seconds. What took you so long? To record. Why are you all pissy? And I'm starting to reach the limit. Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. Oh, we did with she a man. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. They're gonna believe a wealthy woman over a child. I wonder if we're out of place here. A uh, little. Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people, too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? Okay, so I'm gonna turn the camera off for a second and then turn it on again. Okay, so continuing... I've been thinking. I needed a same point. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people! You mean the fan side? I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. <laughs> Shouldn't we be able to help him out? I didn't even think of such a possibility. But it's true that with that power, we may be able to help people out. But that means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Indeed. That can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? Fine by me. I want to help people. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? Sure. No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. I mean, I'm already making all the decisions right now, so... Where's my say in this? But... Lady Ann made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Uh, well, 
Should we decide on a name for our group? Oh. Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I've got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. How about the diamonds? <laughs> Good, the way that you said it, the diamonds. No. I'm getting the real Little League Baseball feel from it. That too. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilé? No. Tile, uh, what? We're not naming it after a fish. That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Oh no, you idiot. Uh, you decide for us. Huh. The book. Your team name may be seen by others when using network services. Please be cautious not to enter any personal information. Furthermore, please do not enter a name that could be considered offensive. The Phantoms. Um, delete. I don't think I have enough space for this. I'm gonna try to stay in touch with the name of uh, my character. Uh, this one. Okay, I need to remove the space if I wanna make it fit. And I think I need to drop an M as well. Then again? Maybe I can just go team. No, team. There we go. Huh. That's not bad at all. A good name. For a rookie. <laughs> we going with that? Yep. Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? Okay, then. There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Like a CEO? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. <laughs> True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Yeah, no, just if, if one of us doesn't agree, nobody goes in. That's just fair. Otherwise, you'd have to go in alone, and if you die, then yeah, that's a problem. And if we need to come in to save you and die as well, then yeah, that's, that's even worse. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. We were done eating. We, we were stuffed. We even puked. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Hey, back to the future. So yeah. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Believe what you will. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? Perhaps. Perhaps? Don't take me for a fool. Very well, I'll leave it at that. 
Let's continue on. There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual, a master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Madarame. Madarame, okay. So I know who my next target is now if, it, if the game forces me to search. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Huh. Start by telling me what you all schemed. Okay, okay. The summary of a story up to this point has been updated. To read, press the triangle button to open the menu, then select story from under the system options. Yeah. Do I get to save now, or...? <laughs> okay. Well, we spent all our money on the buffet, but we officially established the Phantom Thieves, so it was totally worth it. All of the money, I still have 6,000 from it, but okay. The Phantom Thieves, huh? I like the sound of that. Yeah, but I gave it a different name, so I would like to see that name appear. I hope we can really help people. I'm curious about the Phantom Aficionado website, too. I wonder who made it. No clue. More importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there was this approval rating thing, but it was only at like 6%. Better than I expected. I guess it's not so bad if you put it that way. But don't you just want to get it higher than that? I bet it'll go up tons if we keep taking down big targets. It's pretty damn exciting if you try and think about it like that. You know, you're actually right. Well then, let's keep working hard from this point on. Plant. Nice. Pretty healthy. Okay, so I will let's be saving now. Because unfortunately, that will be all for this part. If you all enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. As always, it's been a pleasure. Until the next one. Bye.